Hello guys, this lesson focuses on series 4 of our dysphagia management process. For better understanding, you can refer to our series 1, 2, 3. In this lesson, we will be exploring the thermotactile stimulation techniques during dysphagia management. Activity 1. Icing techniques. There are two variations of icing techniques. We have the hay icing and the sea icing. Hay icing is fast icing techniques which is inhibitory in nature. It is used in the case of a patient with hypertonicity. The techniques involve quick swiping or scrolling along the muscle fiber arrangement. Sea icing is facilitatory in nature and it is used in a patient with hypertonicity. The techniques involve slow swap along the muscle fiber arrangement of the oral musculature. During icing techniques, Avoid additional tactile stimulation on the oral musculature by eliminating unwanted touch activity 2 cold spoon application. During this process, give a distal proximal quick swap as seen in this video. Activity 3. Brushing Techniques During this process, do a quick check of the oral cavity by inspecting for bruises, damage, or any broken skin or abrasions before applying your brush. At the beginning, make sure the mouth is closed, well sealed up. Apply your brush from side to side, giving the maximum stimulation 5 to 10 times. Maintain same pressure throughout this process. Give a distal proximal swipe five times on both sides of the mouth. Tap upper and lower lip for effective stimulation. Encourage tongue protrusion and give five swipe with the same pressure. Activity 4. Vibration Techniques During these techniques, avoid applying vibrating brush or vibrating device on the teeth as this has a tendency to damage or weaken the patient's teeth. This process must be directed towards the gum and apply from side to side for 5 to 10 times. After this, Apply your vibration over the temporal mandibular joint on both sides for 60 seconds each. Activity 5 Manual Manipulation Techniques. This process involves a deep secondary rubbing over the cheek followed by a tapping of the cheek muscle belly 10 times and bilateral proximal distal stroking of the lower jaw 5 times or as recommended by your therapist. Manipulate upper and lower lid with both hands and in case of pediatric population one hand can be used. And end this session with an oral inspection to be sure that there is no any unwanted particles or a leftover device in the patient's mouth.